You want us to wake up the boy? I'll do it. Where's Malcolm Ford? Did you get my messages? I did. You've been waiting long? No, only 45 minutes, but that's okay. I don't mind getting dressed up and waiting an hour. It's good for my confidence. Yeah, I feel like a jerk. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> What? I'm totally messing with you. You're kidding? Yeah. <laughs> I just thought I'd have a little fun with you. Seriously? Mm -hmm. Are those Crocs? All I want you just to be there for me and love me. And go through this together. Just be there. There's no freaking way. Tom, please, you have to help me. But you have to promise me something. What is that? You have to promise me you're not gonna get attached. There's no girlfriend boyfriend. You gotta be kidding me. Don't you touch me! So I meet this guy, right? And he talks to me on the phone. Philip. And, and no, Jonathan. Jonathan. So he tells me, hey, come over, I'm making steaks. Hold on, where's Philip? Just listen to me. I'm listening. Where was Philip? Hey, Philip is gone a long time ago, uh, right? Okay. Remember? Philip? I can't. So, Jonathan invites me over and he tells me on Who's Jonathan? I've never heard this name before. Doesn't matter, just listen over. Right. Right. You know I won't get that lucky. They would bury me alive. Elizabeth, I can protect you. You were forced to do those things. Well, I should have said no. Hey, what were you doing on my laptop? It was on a bed. Couldn't sleep because all this freaking noise coming from your movie. I said if it was too loud, you should have said something. Well, I thought I'd go online. You went poking around my laptop? Poking around? I opened it. There it was, right on the screen. If you don't want me to see it, why'd you leave it up there? How much did you read? The whole thing? The whole thing. <laughs>